I've always been concerned about heart and stroke due to my husband dying at the age of 45 of a stroke. And um, I have uh, been involved with heart and stroke as a captain and um, as a, what, a person going door to door, canvassing, canvassing um, in the past. And then uh, just lately, I myself have had problems a heart attack two years ago and then a cardiac arrest in June and so I was called to be the captain again this year and when Kit heard what had happened to me she asked me if I would be the spokesperson um, because I had been through the whole realm of things through volunteering and also through my family being involved. I think it's important for people to know and, and I myself didn't even realize the leaps and bounds that have happened since 1986. Well actually since I graduated in a year eons ago from nursing and the different treatment now in that we used to put someone on bed rest for four weeks and now uh, with the open heart surgery and MRIs and everything that's come along and it would not have happened without the money that's been raised through heart and stroke and so of course you know I'm I'm eager to see that more develops because my children are certainly at risk with having on both sides of the family uh, cardiac and stroke. Well, I have tell recruiters in motion they are calling all, all of Chatham Kent and asking anybody if they would like to volunteer and canvas door to door on their street amongst where they know their own neighbors and their own friends. And uh, we have several streets in Chatham Kent still open. And if we have open streets, that's you know, uh, lots of people on those streets willing to give. And if we don't have someone on the street to canvas, then you know we can't receive those uh, funds that really do help people like Carol Ann and uh, many others here in Chatham Kent. Uh, you know, 1,700 each year just from. Uh, heart and stroke related disease so every little bit that we can bring in is helpful now come February you can expect to see somebody at your door and asking to donate uh, to uh, the heart and stroke and you'll see them you'll know it's them they'll have a little kit with them as well they'll have a badge they'll be wearing on their shirt so you know their heart and stroke and some may uh, even come just uh, the last week before February the moment they get their kids so uh, we are really in need of volunteers this year to get out there on the streets.